Mark II Giant Robot. The Kuratas is a $1.4 million robot weighing in at a massive 4 tons. On the weapon side, it is equipped with several BB Gatling guns capable of spitting 6,000 rounds a minute. Additionally, these can be set to fire when the pilot smiles, a unique feature we are sure. At 6 tons and controlled by two pilots, the Mark II fires 3-pound paint cannonballs at speeds of over 100 miles per hour, 160 kilometers an hour. The company plans to create a futuristic sports league where the giant robots batter each other into submission. Cormorant UAV The Tactical Robotics Cormorant is an unmanned flying car UAS designed by Tactical Robotics LTD. It will be used in search and rescue operations where it would be too dangerous or inaccessible for a helicopter. Designed by Israeli firm Tactical Robotics, the Cormoran is designed to deliver troops, civilian passengers or other cargo within tight quarters, where helicopters with exposed rotor blades just can't go. With the UAV in its name standing for Unmanned Aerial Vehicle, the idea is that it will perform these tasks either autonomously or by remote control. The Cormoran's autopilot relies primarily on inertial and ground reference, which is more complex than flying through open, unobstructed airspace. This demonstrates the Cormoran's capability to operate close to the ground and inside obstructed terrain, in environments previously inaccessible to existing aircraft, having similar payload. Titan, the robot. Titan, the robot. How it works. It is enhanced by various actuators and electronic devices, resembling a humanoid robot that is worn by an actor who moves the appendages of the costume and controls electronic functions like sound effects from the inside of the costume. Titan the robot stands head, shoulders, and body above the crowd. An eye-catching, high-profile walkabout act to wow your visitors. With flashing eyes, outstanding panel work, and a built-in water gun. Go-Between Police Robot It slides out from the front of a police vehicle and is the first contact the driver has with the authorities. Instead of a face, this Robocop has two cameras, a speaker and a microphone. It also has a screen on which you can see the human police officer's face. The good intentions pour from this idea. The Robocop isn't going to pull a gun on you. He doesn't come to you with the possibility of an aggressive, threatening posture. When a vehicle is pulled over, the officer dispatches the go-between robot, which is attached to a platform on the driver's side of the police car, by extending a rolling aluminum track to the motorist's window. The robot is perched atop the end of the track, which moves forward on a small wheel. At the same time, a spike strip attached to the robot is lowered to the ground and unfolded between the vehicle's front and rear tires. Cormoran K-7 the Cormoran K-7 is a hybrid watercraft launched by luxury vessel manufacturer Cormoran. The transformable watercraft incorporates automotive and aviation technologies, which enable it to sail, drive, and fly on water. The monocoque is made of carbon fiber with automotive standards and integrated Formula One technology to achieve a lightweight body. From a catamaran in the standard driving mode, the powerboat can be transformed into a trimaran which can glide at a low speed in shallow waters and dock easily in a special docking mode. Vast Haven 1. Vast is thrilled to embark on this journey of launching the world's first commercial space station, Haven 1, and its first crew, Vast 1. We are grateful to SpaceX for this exciting partnership that represents the first steps in VAST's long-term vision of launching much larger, artificial gravity space stations in Earth orbit and beyond. Space startup VAST plans to launch the world's first commercial space station, called Haven 1. It is scheduled to launch on a SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket to low Earth orbit no earlier than August 2025. Haven 1 will initially act as an independent crewed space station prior to being connected as a module to a larger vast space station currently in development. The mission will be quickly followed by Vast 1, the first human spaceflight mission to Haven 1 on a SpaceX Dragon spacecraft.
Hyperport Hyperloop itself is not a brand but an open source technology developed by Tesla and SpaceX. Tesla CEO and SpaceX founder Elon Musk has encouraged engineering companies to develop the idea independently to his own ventures. The technology was designed to transport passengers in a capsule or pod through a sealed tube or system of tubes. Hyperloop TT is one of several companies hoping to create usable networks from the technology. It can either move two 20-foot containers or 140 or 45-foot container. The system is designed to transport freight between cities through Hyperloop TT's low-pressure tubes. Batman Batpod Bike The rider of the Batpod is essentially forced to lie down. Therefore, Batman is unable to ride the Batpod like a motorcycle, and he is forced to lie down while riding the vehicle. If you lie down on the vehicle, you can greatly enhance the speed of the vehicle, and the modern-day Grand Prix drivers are an example of why lying down on the vehicle can help you to increase the speed aerodynamically. While chasing the Joker at high speeds, the handlebars stick out, and shields are used to save the Batman's hands, especially when he has to ride at very high speeds. The grappling cannons round out the Batpod's heavy artillery mix in the front. These strong hooks are capable of piercing almost any material. With the help of Hollywood magic, these hooks were used to pierce almost anything and add fun and drama to the chases. Aquanaut Underwater Robot Aquanaut is a multi-purpose subsea robot which employs a patented shape-shifting transformation from an autonomous underwater vehicle, AUV, to a remotely operated vehicle, ROV, removing the need for vessels and tethers. The vehicle enables both the efficient collection of data over long distances as well as manipulation of subsea objects at a significantly lower cost than today's technology. Here is a robot that transforms from a submarine into a half-humanoid with two arms to take on tasks underwater. The Aquanaut by Houston Mechatronics has sensors to gather data. In submarine mode, it cruises long distances to get to its destination. PebbleFlow Electric RV Electric RV Specialist Pebble has officially unveiled its flagship product, an all-electric travel trailer called the PebbleFlow. For easier off-grid living, Pebble has equipped its electric RV with one kilobus of integrated solar atop the roof, enabling self-charging from the sun whether parked or in motion. No matter if you're out in the wild or parked at home, the PebbleFlow's 45 chlor lithium iron phosphate LFP battery pack can not only power all appliances on board, 